guys, welcome back to the Girl and Girl Bookworm. So a lot of you have been asking for a bookshelf tour and I'm nervous about doing it but I'm going to try so no promises that this video will be a good video but um, we're going to attempt this. I normally film on my computer or I film right now like I'm on my iPhone so normally I don't, like I'm not fancy enough to have like the tripod and everything like that so I can't make promises that this is going to even look nice but I'm going to attempt it. Um, so let's just get started. I'm going to show you a brief overview of at least the reading room um, for a part one. And then we also have my bookshelf that's out in my foyer. So we just need to get started. Okay, so for some reason this is super zoomed in. But here's a brief overview of this room. Where the spice racks up there. I was going to put the Pop Funkos up there and then I changed my mind. So just brief overview, you can kind of tell that this side is more of my like adult side and then this side is kind of more my YA side. And then I also have this little bookshelf right here, which has some of my like favorites on it. And then we have this bookshelf too right here, which also has a lot of my favorites on it. Alright, so we're going to start with this shelf. This is... um. I guess you can count both of these shelves. These are mostly my um, book of the month books. I also have Into Thin Air, which is downstairs right now, but eventually it would go kind of around this area. Let's just get started. So the first book on the shelf is The Couple Next Door by Sherry LaPena. Or LaPena. Bad thing is these books are kind of pushed forward, so they like to push back. Um, Fierce Kingdom by Jen Phillips. The Widower's Wife by Kate Hollihan. Um, Lies She Told also by Kate Hollihan. The Sister's Chase by Sarah Healy. Um, the Final Girls by Riley Sager. Dead Letters by Kate Dolan Leach. Um, Woman Number 17 by Eden or Eden Lapuki. I like to call it. I don't think that's right though. Um, Swimming Lessons by Claire Fuller. Um, American Fire by Monica Hesse. I'm going to move him over here for a second. Uh, Alright, more Book of the Month books. And then we've got After the Eclipse by Sarah Perry. The Dark Lake by Sarah Bailey. Nope, that's not going to want to go back in there. I'll have to fix that later. Um, the Trespasser by Tanya French. I think this is like the fourth book in her series. Um, but I don't have the first three, so I don't know why I own this. Um, Little Fires Everywhere by Celeste Ng. Artemis by Andy Weir. A Life Bet the Wife Between Us by Greer Hendricks and Sarah Peckinen. Um, The Woman in the Window by AJ Finn. And As Bright as Heaven by Susan Mesner. Um, I'm going to keep just going and then I'll do all the pink shelves first and then I'll move. So then we got The Wedding Dress by Rachel Hawk. These are all by Rachel Hawk, by the way. The Wedding Chapel. The Wedding Shop. The Writing Desk. Once Upon a Prince. Princess Ever After. How to Catch a Prince. A royal Christmas wedding, and then I've got an extra copy of the wedding dress and the Christmas wedding. Ooh, my arm's getting tired already. Let's see. Move these. Also, sorry guys. All right, so we've got the truth about the Harry Colbert affair by Joel Dicker. Go back in. Bella. Sorry, she was scratching my chair. The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo by Stieg Larson. The Girl Who Played with Fire by Stieg Larson. I don't know why I just said that twice, but. The Girl Who Kicked the Hornet's Nest. Where They Found Her by Kimberly McCrate. 
Reconstructing Amelia by Kimberly McCright. If I Run by Terry Blackstock. And then If I'm Found by Terry Blackstock. So these are kind of thrillery-ish books. Some of these used to be on this shelf, but once I got more Book of the Month books, I took them down. Um, more thriller books. So I've got um, I Let You Go by Kate, um, not Kate, Claire McIntosh. Um, I See You by Claire McIntosh. The Queen of the Night by Alexander Chi. The Girl on the Train by Paula Hawkins. Into the Water by Paula Hawkins. Some of these are Book of the Month books, but because they go with other authors, I kind of let them be separated. In a Dark Dark Wood by Ruth Ware. The Woman in Cabin 10 by Ruth Ware. And then also The Lion Game by Ruth Ware. <laughs> These shelves are where it gets tricky because they're, they're not upside down, but they're sideways. Um, this is my Jennifer Probst pile. So we've got Everywhere in Every Way. Anytime, Any Place. All or Nothing at All by Jennifer Probst. I already said that this was her shelf. I don't know why I repeated myself. Um, Searching for Someday by Jennifer Probst. Searching for Perfect by Jennifer Probst. Searching for Beautiful by Jennifer Probst. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Searching for Always by um, by Jennifer Probst. The Marriage Bargain. The Marriage Trap. The Marriage Mistake. And the Marriage Merger. Alright, so this is more adults, more kind of thrillery. I don't know why the Martian ended up here, but it did, so we'll just start that one. Um, the Martian by Andy Weir. Just get out of the way. Summer House with a Swimming Pool by Herman Koch. The Dinner by Herman Koch. The Good Girl by Mary Kubeka. Pretty Baby by Mary Kubeka. Don't You Cry by Mary Kubeka. D Dark Places by Jillian Flynn. Sharp Objects by Jillian Flynn. And then two copies of Gone Girl. Oops. So this is my Leanne Moriarty um, shelf. Um, I own all of her books that she's released so far. So I've got The Last Anniversary, Three Wishes, The Hypnotist's Love Story, What Alice Forgot, The Husband's Secret, Big Little Lies, and Truly Madly Guilty. As we move over here, we've got some of my like historical fiction, a lot of Kate Quinn, um, Daughters of Rome by Kate Quinn, The Mistress of Rome, Empress of the Seven Hills, Lady of the Eternal City, The Serpent and the Pearl, and The Lion and the Rose, all by Kate Quinn. Then we've got Nefertiti and Cleopatra's Daughter, all by Michelle Moran. So it's the pink shelf, and then we'll move down below. We've got some Lisa Scottline books, so kind of more thrillery books. So we've got Coming, uh, not Coming, but Come Home, Look Again, Keep Quiet. In Every 15 Minutes, all by Lisa Scotland. Got The Girl in 6B by A.E. Tour. And What She Knew by 
Gilly or Jilly McMillan. More books that are going to be difficult to take out. Um, these are other thrillery books. So I've got The Pocket Wife by Susan Crawford. Um, the Postcard Killers by James Patterson and Lisa Marklund. Marklund. Um, the Rocks by Peter Nichols. Sister Dear by Laura McNeil. Little Pretty Things by Lori Raider Day. Before We Met by Lucy Whitehouse. The Pilot's Wife by Anita Shreve. Lie for Me by Karen Young. Behind Closed Doors by B.A. Paris. More historical fiction over here. I don't know why Anna's even over here. She should be over there. Alright. Um, so these are my Philippa Gregory books. We've got The White Queen by Philippa Gregory. The Red Queen by Philippa Gregory. The Lady of the Rivers by Philippa Gregory. The Kingmaker's Daughter. The White Princess. The King's Curse. And the other Boleyn Girl all by Philippa Gregory. That shelf just has miscellaneous stuff on it. And then we've got this shelf which is kind of thrillery and miscellaneous-ish. Um, so we've got Wild Ride by Jennifer Cruz and Bob Mayer. You Should Have Known by Jean um, Hanf Courtly? I, don't, I can't read that. It's like cursive weird. weird. Um, you by Carolyn Kepnes. Pretty Girls by Karen Slaughter. The Kind Worth Killing by Peter Swanson and Into the Darkest Corner by Elizabeth Haynes. Um, historical fiction again. So we've got All the Light We Cannot See by Anthony Doerr. A Tale for the Time Being by Ruth Ozeki. The Next by Nathan Hale. It's not historical fiction. So I don't know why this got in here. Ready Player One by Ernest Klein. Same thing with us when the are racing in the rain by Garth Stein. Um, the Loyal Heart by Shelley Shepard Gray. An Uncommon Protector by Shelley Shepard Gray. Mrs. Mrs. Lee and Mrs. Gray by Dorothy Love. The Soldier's Wife by Margaret Leroy. And Water for Elephants by Sarah Groon. Alright, we have um, some Jackie Collins books that didn't go on the other shelf out in the hallway. And it's, we got Married Lovers by Jackie Collins. Lovers and Players by Jackie Collins. Deadly Embrace. And then American Star by Jackie Collins. So here's my nonfiction shelf. So I have... Um, Scrappy Little Nobody by Anna Kendrick. She Said Yes by Misty Burnell. For One More Day by Mitch Album. He's not nonfiction, but I stuck him in here anyways. Um, Tuesdays with Maury. The Five People You Meet in Heaven. The Child Called It by Dave Pelzer. The Lost Boy by Dave Pelzer. And A Man Named Dave by Dave Pelzer. Wild by Cheryl Strayed. The Zookeeper's Wife by Diane Ackerman. We'll Always Have Paris by Jennifer um, Coburn. Brain on Fire by Susanna. Um, oh my goodness, I always mess her name up. Callahan. It's not Callahan though. Um, In the Blink of an, the eye, of an Eye by Michael Waltrip. And then... Licensed Upon by Rick Harrison. And the last one in this shelf is kind of miscellaneous. It was just kind of books that ended up getting put over here. But we've got The Selection by Kira Cass. The Elite by Kira Cass. The One. The Air. And 
the Crown uh, by Kira Cass. Um, a Place at Our Table by Amy Clipston. The Austin Escape by Catherine Ree. And Perennials by Julie Cantrell. Okay, I'm not going to take those down, but I have all my Agatha Christie books. I've got Murder on the Orient Express. And then there were nine, Five Little Pigs, Peril at, of N House, The ABC Murders, um, and then there were nine again, Toward Zero, The Labor of Hercules, Murder at the Viscarge, The Body in the Library, Evil Under the Sun, A Murder is Announced, The Murder of Roger Ackroyd, and The, Mur the Mysterious Affair of at Styles. Alright, so I'm going to have to move my little friends for a second. Alright, so we have The Girls at Mischief Bay by Susan Mallory. Friends We Keep by Susan Mallory. Oh, keep going. Million Little Things by Susan Mallory. Um, the Cure for the Common Breakup by Beth Kendrick. New Uses for Old Boyfriends. Put a Ring on It. Once Upon, wi Upon a Wine and The Bake Off, all by Beth Kendrick. Mystic Summer, The Lake Season, and The Summer House, all by Hannah McKinnon. Um, Picture Perfect. Um, the Icing on the Cake by Janice Thompson, The Dream Dress, Bouquet of Love, Fool's Russian, Swinging on a Star, and It Had to Be You, all by Janice Thompson. Betting on Hope, Counting on a Cowboy, Kissed by a Cowboy, all by Derek Clopton. Things You Won't Say, and The Perfect Neighbors by Sarah Pekkanen. Santorini Sunsets, Monarch Beach, Lake Como, French Coast, and Market Street, all by Anita Hughes. Leaving Time, 19 Minutes, and The Pact by Jodi Picoult. Um, the Secret Keeper, and The Forgotten Garden by Kate Morton. Alright, we've got On Dublin Street by Samantha Young. Rush by Maya Banks, Fever by Maya Banks, Burn by Maya Banks, If I Were You, Being Me, Revealing Us, I Belong to You, and No In Between by Lisa Renee Jones, Fifty Shades of Grey, Fifty Shades Darker, and Fifty Shades Free, all by E.L. James. Um, chose the wrong guy, gave him the wrong finger. It could, if I could turn back time. Driving with the top down, all by Beth Harrison. The Secret Life of Ella and Micah. And The Temptation of Lila and Ethan by Jessica Sorensen. The Memory of You, and The Things We Knew by Katherine West. Save the Date, and The Weekenders by Mary-Kate Andrews. I've Got Your Number, Wedding Night, Twenties Girl, The Undomestic Goddess, Can You Keep a Secret, Finding Audrey in Remember Me by Sophie Kinsella. 
Baby Proof and First Comes Love by Emily Griffin. We have Beautiful Disaster, Walking Disaster, A Beautiful Wedding, and Beautiful Oblivion by Jamie McGuire. Losing It and Faking It by Cora Carmack. Bear to You, Reflected in You, Entwined with You, Captivated by You, and Pleasures of the Night by All by Sylvia Day. Burning Moon, Almost a Bride, Finding You, All by Joe Watson. One Week to the Wedding, The Winter Wedding Plan by Olivia Miles. Paper Princess, The Broken Prince, The Twisted Palace, and Fallen Air, all by Aaron Watt. Now Tuck It Sisters, The Guest Cottage, and Moonshell Beach by Nancy Thayer. The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants, The Second Summer of the Sisterhood, Girls in Pants, Forever in Blue, Sisterhood Everlasting All by Amber Shears, and then we also have Things I Can't Explain by Mitchell Kriegman. That finishes that show. And come down here. I've got Wedding Cake by Lynn Hinton. Two of a Kind by Yona Zeldis McDonough, McD McDonough. Emma's Table by Philip Gallings. Summer at Little Beach Street Bakery by Jenny Colgan. All I Ever Wanted Was Everything by Janelle Brown. The Seafront Tea Room by Vanessa Green. 800 Grapes by Laura Davis. Or Daves. Summer Secrets by Jane Green. The Nest by Cynthia Dupree Sweeney. Looking for Me by Beth Hoffman. This is my Denise Hunter shelf. I've got Barefoot Summer. Dancing with Fireflies. The Wishing Season. Mary Till Monday, Sweetbriar Cottage, Falling Like Snowflakes, The Goodbye Bride, Just a Kiss, and Blue Ridge Sunrise, all by Denise Hunter. Um, the Wedding Promise by Thomas Kincaid. Call me Mr. Irres oh no. Call me Irresistible by Susan Elizabeth Phillips. Um, the Great Escape by Susan Elizabeth Phillips. The Summer of Love by Katie Ford. You'll Think of Me by Robin Hatcher. The Sweet Smell of Magnolias and Memories by Celeste Fletcher McHale. The Irresistible Blueberry Bake Shop and Cafe by Mary Sine Sims. No Ordinary Life by Susan Redfern. The Way We Were by si um, Shanae Moriarty. When We Were Friends by Elizabeth Joy Arnold. Firefly Lane by Kristen Hanna. My Mother's Secret by Sheila O'Flanagan. Shot Through the Heart by Matt Kane. The Time Traveler's Wife by Audrey Niffenegger. On the Island by Tracy Garvis Graves. Flatwater Tuesday by Ron Irwin. Where'd You Go, Bernadette by Maria Semple. The Ascension of Larks by Rachel Linden. 
and then The Summer of Good Intentions by Wendy Francis. The Almost Archer Sisters by Lisa Gabrielle. Catch Up Clouds by Annabelle Pitcher. And then Wicked by Gregory Maguire. The Naughty List by Donna Kaufman, Cynthia Eden, and Suzanne, Susan Fox. Ten Tiny Breaths by K.A. Tucker. Sinful by Lori Foster, Maggie Shane, Suzanne um, Forster, and Kimberly Ray. Easy by Tamara Weber. I used to own the sequel, but I since unhauled it because I didn't like it. The Strip by J.J. Salem. Bodyguards in Bed by Lucy Monroe, Jamie Denton, and Elizabeth Naughton. Guilty Pleasure by Laura Lee. That Mistletoe Moment by Kat Johnson, Kate Engel, Allison Charles. And Palm South University Season 1 Box Set by Candy Steiner. This is really little shelf. These are all my mass markets. The Princess Bride by William Goldman. The Sweet Kiss of Summer by Sophie Gunn. Trouble in Texas by Katie Lane. Peach Cobbler Murder by Joanne Fluke. And then One Night Stand by Cindy Kirk. That time I joined the circus by J.J. Howard. The Green Mountain Kids by Matthew Pierce. The Afterlife of Holly Chase and Cynthia um, by Cynthia Hand. There's Someone Inside Your House by Stephanie Perkins. Going up because I forgot this is part of the news shelves. Um. From What I Remember by Stacey Kramer and Valerie Thomas. Reality Chick by Lauren Brunholt. Windfall by Jennifer E. Smith. Alex Approximately by Jen Bennett. Oh! The Probability of Miracles by Wendy Wonder. For Real by Allison Cherry. The Last Time We Say Goodbye by Cynthia Hand. Crushworthy by Sarah Lawrence. 13 Reasons Why by Jay Asher. All the Bright Places by Jennifer Niven. Once and for All by Sarah Dessen. And Seven Ways Be Lie by Riley Redgate. This shelf we have The Missing Girl by Norma Fox Mazur. Suicide Notes from Beautiful Girls by Lynn Weingarten. Velvet Undercover by Terry Brown. Famous Last Words by Katie Allender. Criminal by Tara Allen McVoy. With Malice by Eileen Cook. Try switching hands. This is Our Story by Ashley Elston. What We Saw by Aaron Hertzler. We Were Liars by E. Lockhart. Whoop. Guess switching hands. That's not a good choice. Um, Violent Ends by this whole slew of authors. They All Fall Down by Roxanne St. Clair. And The Truth About Alice by Jennifer Mathieu. Here, I'm not going to take these down either, but we've got my three Harry Potter Illustrated Editions on all of my Cassandra Clare books. So the entire Infernal Devices, the all, all of the Mortal Instruments, the Bane Chronicles, and the Tales of Shadowhunter Academy. And then we 
we've got Until Friday Night by Abby Glines, Under the Lights by Abby Glines, My Life Next Door, and What I Thought Was True by Huntley Fitzpatrick, Second Chance Summer, Amy and Rogers Epic Detour, The Unexpected Everything, and Since You've Been Gone by Morgan Matson. Welcome to the Dark House and Return to the Dark House by Lori Faria Solares. How to Disappear by Anne Reddish Stampler. Pretty Girl 13 by Liz Coley. Before I Fall by Lauren Oliver. Panic. Vanishing Girls. And Rooms all by Lauren Oliver. For a second. Um, Legend by Marie Lu. Prodigy and Champion by Marie Lu. Across the Universe. A Million Suns and Shades of Earth, all by Beth Revis. And then a Replica by Lauren Oliver. Nantucket Blue, Nantucket Red by Layla Howler Howland, Torn Away, and Hate List by Jennifer Brown, Tiny Pretty Thing, and Shiny Broken Pieces by Sona Ch Charp, I can never say her name, and Danielle Clayton, I apologize. Eleanor and Park. Fangirl, and Landline All by Rainbow Rowell, and then Rebel Bell by Rachel Hawkins. Sweet Venom by Tara Lynn Child, Sweet Shadows, and Sweet Legacy by Tara Lynn Child. Delirium, Pandemonium, Requiem by Lauren Oliver. I'm kind of not planning on taking these out. Right now I'm like squished against my reading chair so I can't really do this shelf justice. But Divergent and Sergeant Allegiant by Veronica Roth. The Testing, Independent Study and Graduation by Joelle Charbonneau. And then The Book of Ivy and the Revolution of Ivy by Amy Engel. Um, the Made of Secrets, Made of Deception, and Made of Wonder all by um, Jennifer McGowan. And we've got Crest. I think y'all know what these look like. Scarlet. Crest. Winter. And Fairest all by Michelle. Um, not Michelle. Whew. Um... Marissa Meyer, and then we've got Heartless also by Marissa Meyer. Again, against my chair, so I can't really pull them out, but Beautiful Creatures, Beautiful Darkness, Beautiful Chaos, Beautiful Redemption, Beautiful Dangerous Creatures, Dangerous Deception, all by Cami Garcia and Margaret Stoll, and then Anna Dressed in Blood, and Girl of Nightmares, all by Kendar Blake. And then the shelf is... Um... The Winner's Curse, The Winner's Crime, The Winner's Kiss by Marie Bartkowski, and then I've got The Kiss of Deception, The Heart of Betrayal, and The Beauty of Darkness, all by Mary E. Pearson. Um, the Lux Beginnings, Lux Consequences, Lux Opposition. Don't Look Back, all by Jennifer um, Ar Armantrout, and then I've got The Maze Runner, The Scorched House, The Kill Order, and The Death Cure, all by James Dashner. Back here, I've got Ophelia by, um, I can't remember the first name, but last name is Klein, um, The Friday Society by somebody named Chris, uh, Out of the Easy Salt to the Sea by Rudisa Petty's. 
The Wrath and the Dawn and The Rose and Dagger by Renee Adier. And then Forgive My Fins, Fins Are Forever and Just for Fins by Tara Lynn Childs. I'm sorry, like I said, this is squished against my chair. I've got um, the Bloodline series by Rochelle Mead, Bloodlines, The Golden Lily, Indigo Spell, the Fiery Heart, The Silver Shadows, and then The Ruby Circle. And then I've got my Twilight books down there. You all definitely know what those look like. Um, I also have the entire Vampire Academy series by Rochelle Mead. I've got Soundless by Rochelle Mead. And then The Game Board of the Gods by Rochelle Mead. Down here, um, I can try to get these out. Um, Wolf by Wolf by Ryan Grodden. Caraval by Stephanie Garber. The Thousandth Floor by Catherine McGee. Shadow and Bone by Lee Bardugo. And then The Crown's Game by Evelyn Skye. We've got Snow Like Ashes by Sarah Roche. Um, the Kingdom Keepers by Ridley Pearson. Dueled by Elise Chapman. Three Dark Crowns by Kendar Blake. Slide by Jill Hathaway. Dorothy Must Die by Danielle Page. Rain of Shadows by Sophie Jordan. I Hunt Killers by Barry Liga. And then Graceling by Kristen Kishore. And that, oh no, nope, I missed a shelf. I almost said I was done. <laughs> I've got Beastly by Alex Flynn. Hunted by Megan Spooner. Scythe by Neil Schusterman. Reawakened and um, recreated by Colleen Hawk. Hawk. Or Hoke. Um, the Goddess Test. Goddess Interrupted. The Goddess Inheritance. And The Goddess Legacy all by Amy Carter. And that wraps up all of the shelves that are on this wall. Alright, for this shelf I was a little bit smarter. I took all the Pop Funkos off and I switched some of them that were sideways so that way they'll be easier to film. Some of these are like my favorites or they just looked really pretty on the shelf. <laughs> so I'm going to start with this shelf to all the boys I loved before. P.S. I Still Love You. Always and Forever. All by Jenny Han. Burn for Burn. Fire with Fire. Ashes to Ashes. All by Jenny Han and Siobhan Vivian. And I've got an earthly hollowed and boundless all by Cynthia Hand. Um, a hundred summers by Beatrice Williams. I've unhauled all my other books by her. Um, Bright Young Things by Anna Godberson. Beautiful Days. And the Lucky Ones by Anna Godverson. I unhauled my Lux series, so. Born of Illusion. And Born of Deception by Terry Brown. Vixen. Ingenue. And Diva by Jennifer. Uh, not Jennifer. Jillian Larkin. This is one of my favorite series of all time. My favorite shelf, well one of my favorites is obviously Taylor Jenkins Reid, so I've got One True Love, Maybe in Another Life, Forever Interrupted, and After I Do, and then The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, all by Taylor, Taylor Jenkins Reid, Love and Gelato by Jenna Evans Welch, I'm so excited there's a sequel coming out for this this year, well not a sequel, but a companion book. Um, the Summer I Turn Pretty Trilogy, so this is a bind above The Summer I Turn Pretty, It's Not Summer Without You, and then We'll Always Have Summer by Jenny Han, and then The Mountain Midwife by Lori Alice Eeks, Horror Store by Grady Hendrix, No One Else Can Have You by Kathleen Hale, whoops, and then Nothing Bad Is Going to Happen by Kathleen Hale. Then I've got um, The Tiger's Curse, Tiger's Quest, Tiger's Voyage, and The Tiger's Destiny by Colleen Hope. 
Um, the Hero's Guide to Saving Your Kingdom. The Hero's Guide to Storming the Castle. And The Hero's Guide to Being an Outlaw, all by Christopher Healy. Then I've got Get Even. Get D Dirty. And then 10, all by Gretchen McNeil. Dangerous Girls and Dangerous Boys by Abigail Haas. Wake Lullaby. Title and Elegy, all by Amanda Hopkins. Um, Daughter of Deep Silence by Carrie Ryan. Nerve by Jean Ryan. <laughs> Need for You by Melissa Marr. Drink Slay Love by Sarah Beth Durst. Eve. Once. And Rise all by Anna Carey. And then I've got The Remedy. The Epidemic. The Program. The Treatment, and The Adjustment, all by Suzanne Young. Overview about this shelf. I'm not going to pull everything off of this shelf because for the most part, you know what most of these look like. So I'm not going to pull down Pretty Little Liars and um, the, Perfect, the Perfectionists by Sarah Shepard. We've got The Hunger Games by Suzanne Collin. Um, my Diane Chamberlain books, I'll pull those out. Um, pretending to Dance. The Stolen Marriage, The Silent Sister, The Escape Artist, Secret Lives, Fire and Rain, The Brass Ring, Necessary Lies, the Midwife's Confession, The Lies Be Told, The Shadow Wife, The Good Father, Keeper of the Light, Kiss River, Her Mother's Shadow, um, Before the Storm, Secret She Left Behind, The Bay at Midnight, The Courage Tree, um, The Summer Child, The Secret Life of C.C. Wilkes, and Breaking the Silence. That one's still dirty. <laughs> um, and then we got my Harry Potter shelf. I'm not going to pull these out. I've got also the Who Was Calling series and Castle Vacancy, but I'm not going to pull all not going to pull all those out. And we got my Ellen Hildebrand shelf. We've also got my Harry Potter and Irish, um, not Irish, but Gaelic that I got from Ireland, the Jungle Book that I'll pull out, my Ellen books. So we've got um, Here's to Us, The Identicals, Silver Girl, um, The Rumor. Summerland, The Island, Beautiful Day, The Matchmaker, The Beach Club, The Blue Bistro, Castaways, Barefoot, Nantucket Nights, The Love Season, The Summer Affair, Winter Street, Winter Stroll, Winter Storms, and Winter Solstice, all by Ellen Hildebrand. Not going to pull these out, but these are my Rick Riordan books, so the Red Pyramid series, the Percy Jackson series, the companion books, which were the Greek gods and Greek heroes, um, the Heroes of Olympus. I do have this book, but it's not here right now. Um, the t first two books in the series um, for Apollo, and then the um, Magnus Chase books. 
Then I come down here and we've got my Nicholas Sparks books and my Nora Roberts books. So we're going to start with these. So we've got A Walk to Remember, Dear John, The Rescue, Two by Two, Message in a Bottle, The Notebook, Safe Haven, The Last Song, The Choice, the Best of Me, At First Sight, True Believer, See Me, The Lucky One, Three Weeks with My Brother, A Ben in the Road, The Guardian, um, Nights in Row Dance. The Wedding, and The Longest Ride, and those are all by Nicholas Sparks. We've got Tonight and Always by Nora Roberts, Summer Pleasures, we've got um, The Calhouns, Catherine, Amanda, and Lila, um, Susanna and Megan from The Calhouns, the Next Always, The Last Boyfriend, The Perfect Hope, Vision in White, Bed of Roses, Savor the Moment, and Happily Ever After, all by Nora Roberts. Then we've got my Debbie McComer books and Jackie Collins books. So we've got, can't get it stuck. Um, the Shop on Blossom Street, A Good Yarn, Susanna's Garden, Back on Blossom Street, 20 Wishes, Summer on Blossom Street, Susanna's, uh, not Susanna, <laughs> Hannah's List, A Turn in the Road, Starting Now, Blossom Street Brides, Last One Home, A Girl's Guide to Moving On, If Not For You, Three Brides and No Groom, Tuesdays at 8, Call Me Mrs. Miracle, and Family Affair by Debbie McComer. Chances, Lucky, Lady Boss, Vendetta, Lucky's Revenge, Dangerous Kiss, Drop Dead Beautiful. Oh yeah, up here is also Confessions of a Wild Child, but I can't get that out right now. Um, poor Little Bitch Girl. Um, Goddess of Vengeance. And the last book we've got is Santangelo's All by Jackie Collins. Hey guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was a little shaky. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any comments on what I've read, what I haven't read, please let me know down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye everybody.